wanna know his secret? What is up guys, it's your boy Milad coming to you on another day with another vlog. So you guys can probably tell I'm already ready to go to the gym, so that's what I'm about to do. But I did wake up like 3-4 hours ago and I started studying for my calculus test that I have tomorrow. I also have a psychology test tomorrow, so this is going to be fun, right? But, someone wanted to say something that was pretty embarrassing. Last night I got home... And I felt pretty good. I was like, oh shit, I got home at 1 a.m. It felt like, okay, I got home at a good time. But then I realized that um, it's daylight savings. So I actually got home at like what would be 2 a.m. But it was a good thing. So I guess kind of I got home earlier. But I still got to spend the extra hour. I don't know. This confuses me sometimes. I spent the extra hour, but I didn't spend the extra hour, if that even makes sense. But hey. I, I didn't realize it till this morning. I was like, wow, it's 1 o'clock. I thought it was like 1 o'clock when I was in Malibu. But, yeah. So, let's get on with the rest of the day. Thought I should share that with you guys. That G-Wagon, though, hey, It's only a G550, though, but it's still sick. It's like a vanilla color. You already know it's that time for me to get gas. 15 miles left in my tank. You gotta get that gas for this school week. Costco lines, as usual. All right, at the gym now, about to go get this workout. I'll catch you guys in a quick second. There's no good lighting in this direction. I feel kind of dark still. But yeah, I just got out of the gym right now. I hit shoulders and bicep. Kind of a little weird day because I usually don't hit shoulders and biceps on the same day. Well, I used to, but I haven't recently. So it kind of felt weird for me. But hey, I got a good workout. And it's been a while since I've gotten a really good workout. So I really needed today. And now I'm feeling good. And I'm going to conquer the rest of the day. And I tripped out looking at the time in my car. Because my time in my car is still an hour ahead. I need to go fix that right now. Alright guys. So nothing really too crazy happened. Just been working on calculus to be honest. I have a psychology test as well tomorrow. But I haven't really been working on that much today. So I've been working on my calculus. You know, I'm studying for tomorrow. So now I'm about to go head out and eat. And then I'm going to come back home and I'm going to have to go back to studying again today. This week is going to be tough. I'm feeling extremely stressed and I know we're going to get through this. We're going to get through this. Well, I mean, I'm going to get through this, but you guys, if you guys are in a similar situation, you're going to get through this as well. G-Wagon. M3. Infinity? Zenko chicken. Hey. The moment when you forget to vlog and you're halfway through your food but you remember so you get that last second vlog footage in of food that's already halfway eaten. We out here at Walmart right now. Shit. McDonald, McDonald, McDonald. I need some ice cream in my body. Right now. I know. Dip cones have been discontinued. Well at this McDonald's says something we know. Got a McFlurry. Hey, 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 hey. M&M's. Back in the crib, working on some calculus. Back in the crib, working on some calculus. Back in the crib, working on some calculus. Okay, I should stop. Alright, so, exactly what I just said. Back at the crib, working on some calculus. Let's do this. 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 A, A. Vision board right there. Keep me focused. Keep me motivated. I don't even know if you guys can see it. Oh, well. Hey, we about to hit the 800 mark. 17 more subscribers to go. Then we hit 800 subscribers. Then comes 900. And then comes the big 1,000. Let's do it, guys. Also, take a look at this. This video is about to hit 100,000 views. We're about 800 views away from hitting 100,000. It's like crazy to think that one of my videos is going to hit that many views. It's going to be an exciting time. Hopefully we'll hit it tomorrow. I have a feeling we'll hit it tomorrow. And yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited when that 100,000 hits. Oof, the 100,000 hits here and then I get the 1,000 subscribers hopefully soon. Damn, y'all got me super excited. Oh my goodness. So right now I'm actually looking at the classes I need to take for next semester. And it's tough. I need to fix a schedule up that works really well. I have my registration tomorrow, so I'm trying to get this done tonight as well. It's not like I had enough on my hands already. 
All right, I just got off the phone right now, had an emotional, motivational talk with Ali, and I don't think I have much of a vlog for today. So I thought, why not just go off the whole vibe of me just coming off the phone call and just keep it going on here on the vlog so you guys get a little bit of it, of it as well. But I mean, the biggest thing, to be honest, for me is excuses. You can make as much excuses as you want, but no matter what, the outcome's gonna stay the same. No matter what excuse you make, you can either make that excuse and just let it be, or you go out, accept that it was your decision that came and made brought you to where you are. It was what you did that brought you to where you are, and you take full responsibility and use that control you have in order to succeed in the future, in order to bring more success to yourself. It's okay if you fail. It's okay if you make a mistake. That's that's what growth is. It's like you're practically guaranteed failures in life if you want to go farther. It's it's guaranteed pretty much. It it's so easy to be comfortable. It's so easy to get into a spot where you're just like, "Okay, I'm comfortable with where I'm at and I I wouldn't want any more anything more." And when you try to go for more and you realize, "Oh shit, this is actually hard. I actually have to put work in." Why should I put this work in when I'm fine right now where I am? That's not how you want to think. You want to think, I have this opportunity and I'm going to make the best out of it. Make the best out of ever every opportunity you have. Because you never know. The one opportunity might be your greatest. I mean, I, I, may, I got 100,000 views on that one video. It, well, it's about to hit 100,000 views. And... I, I realized I had the opportunity to actually start making more from YouTube, start uploading more on YouTube, and start like actually growing this channel. And I've taken that opportunity, and this is where I'm at today. I'm like, what, 65 days in a row vlogging. I would have never imagined that. I put the work in. I try my best with these. I try my best with school. And it's it's fun, to be honest. The challenge is fun. I enjoy the challenge, but it is tough. It's a challenge. Nothing in life... Is worth it if it's easy you get tired of it you get bored of it it's always the things that are difficult that you enjoy the most don't forget to enjoy the journey on your way there and also enjoy your destination as well so that's it for today's vlog hope I motivated some of you guys hope you guys are doing well hope you guys had a wonderful day wish you guys the best of success and I really mean it and peace Oh shit, some girl was way too tight. The fellow I'm here. Hey, someone got. Oh shit. So, woo. Woo. Hey, yeah. Hey, hey, put down my wall.